Scotch Evans reporting live from the set of an independent film down in the Meatpacking District. We don't want to reveal the title right now because it's top, top secret. I'm here with the director, Steve Clark. Any complaints with the crew so far? No. Any complaints at all? No. Can you give me any gossip? No. Is there anything you can say? No. Scotch Evans, back to you, Ted. Thanks. Jesus Christ, man. You should be leaning in and don't tell me about it. And then you can be like, <laughs> no, it's not. You don't have to take the chair with you. Okay. That's not nice. Don't tell me about it. Okay. Oh. 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 Rob, what's it been oh, like? Oh, hi. How are you? <laughs> Hello. Good to see the camera. Rob, what's it like working with uh, Steve Clark, the director? <laughs> Stephen Clark is... I have found a few times in my life where the universe opens up and you just for a glimpse realize that anything is possible. Scotch Evans reporting live from the set of a very independent film and I'm here with the sound man Eben Baum. Eben, how's it going so far? Pretty good, pretty good. You know, it's crazy but uh, things are going really good. What's it like working with Scotch Evans? Scotch Evans. I mean, is it cool? Yeah, he's cool. Yeah. I mean, is he sexy? Um, yeah. Do you find him attractive? Um, no, I think the uh, some of the chicks do, though. The chicks are kind of yeah, in? Chicks dig him, yeah. Chicks dig him. They're into me, you mean, because I'm Scotch Evans. Hey, I took one of those little blue pills about a half an hour ago. I'm sure you did, because they're working for you. Oh, yeah. Do you have a boyfriend? Uh, no, I don't. Were there sparks flying in there, or was that just me? I think there were definitely sparks from you, yeah. So I was hot. Uh, no, I think I was hot, so the sparks were flying from you. Right, right. Thank you so much for clarifying. Well, I would say that a lot of my career has been based on the fact that I have chemistry with about everything. Really? I've often wondered that about actors. So if you were to play, like, say, <laughs> a uh, homosexual. Done it. <laughs> Quite the a results, few. The results were... Sparky. Outstanding. Yeah, Sparky. Yeah. Because we were thinking maybe that we might just change this film and have Jack stop the wedding to carry you off into the sunset. Now you're talking a movie. Yeah. Do you do massage? I do. You do? I do. Because I have a kink in the back of my neck. And Can you check that out? Yeah, could you, could you yeah, yeah. check it out for me? Yeah. Ow! Yeah. God! I'm cured. Exactly. Thank you so much for coming down. No problem. Listen up, I'm Scotch Evans, and I like to party. I party big. And this is our line producer, Tori Lytle? Tori Little. Liddell. Liddell. Mm -hmm. Now, why is your name pronounced so weird? Uh, that's a very good question. It's just that you have bad enunciation, and so I would actually pin that one on you. Oh, so you're putting that on me? Yes. What has it been like working with Scotch Evans? It's been one of the greatest thrills of my life. I mean, I, a man who actually went to the gym for the last couple of months in training for this role, mm -hmm. I mean, it was just amazing. His body is so toned, all that. It's just been a, you know, a pleasure to see him in outfits like this. So you like to see a toned man on set? The, there's nothing quite like it. I mean, there are all these nurses and all running around, but Scotch's gladiator outfit, I mean, it's really something else. It's a lot of man. <laughs> it's almost too much. <laughs> almost too much, man. Can you can you see my biceps? Scotch Evans and my biceps reporting live from in front of Lotus Nightclub in downtown Manhattan. I believe they call it the Meat Packing District with my main man, Francoise. Francoise, what do you do on this film? Well, basically, I'm an intern, but in practice, I do a whole lot more. I'm catering, I'm a stand-in, I'm cool, so like. Are you responsible for the granola bars? Oh yeah, especially the, the, the granola bar, like the most important part of a set. I mean, <laughs> we're nothing without it. Can you tell me why there's no decent craft service on this shoot? That's a good point. There normally is, but um, the guy who plays Scotch Evans, he, he just destroys it. He shows up to work first, and, you know, he just destroys the whole table. I mean, boxes of donuts, all the coffee, everything just goes right down, right into his mouth. 
Sometimes an actor gets hungry because he's working, but you wouldn't know about that, would you? Back to you, Ted. I'm gonna get my freak on. Fucking A. Lead off, dude, talk to me. I'm your boy. Oh, one more, sure, put it on my tab. And then the next thing you know, you're sweating. You're telling rudderless stories. You're rubbing ice cubes on some girl named Ann. Any screw ups on sound so far? Um. <laughs> Evan, be honest with me, man. Tell me the truth. Give me the skinny on this. Uh, you know, we got a couple shadows and stuff, but, uh, you know, we're working with it. Yeah, but who's really screwing up on this shoot? <laughs> hmm. Go ahead, say it. I don't know. Carlos Velasquez? Maybe. Thomas Moffat? <laughs> I'm out of here. <laughs> How about Steve Clark, dude? Tell me the truth. Tell me the truth, man. Back to you, Ted. Before you're making films. You're making yeah. films. Yeah. Just, uh, Film is sort of uh, oxygen. Yeah. You know? Kind of like your love. Yeah. You know? I don't like to try out cliches. And I don't really feel like there's anything cliched about the truth. <laughs> what was it like working with Scotch Evans on the film? He was very clean. He smelled good. He shaved his arms. He did everything good for us. It was amazing. So do you think women find the shaved arms attractive? Definitely. Definitely. Yeah. Uh, oh my God, the things you must have seen, that must have been terrible. Those goddamn Ruskies. Yeah. We should have taken them out they when we had the chance. Like Annabelle, What's up, I like the vibe that I'm getting from you. I'm glad, I'm glad, I'm glad you like it. Yeah. yeah. Do you find a man in loincloth enticing? Not really, but you know, I definitely mm -hmm. think about it now. Yeah. You want to go grab a drink? Yeah, let's go. Yeah, let's get out of here. <laughs> Scotch Evans, back to you, Ted. Thanks for having me on the show, Scotch. You do a heck of a job. Rob Bogue, ladies and gentlemen, back to you. Scotch, can't Ted. teach charisma. I actually do a workshop if you're interested. <laughs> Let me ask you a quick question. Have you been working out? Every minute of the day. You look big, you look pumped, you look strong. Is that exciting? A little bit, you know. I like to touch myself sometimes. But, you know, same for you, man. I mean, those those guns are pretty impressive. Thank you, sir. I appreciate that. Where are you going? <laughs> Scotch Evans, still reporting live, still on the set of a film with several titles. Back to you, Ted. Yeah.